to do something, and I am tired of saying there's nothing we can do when we're doing nothing. Representative McGarvey summed up the feelings of many as gun violence continues to happen almost daily, not just in Louisville, but around the country. Now people are saying no more. This is Wave News at 11. I'm Marissa Burke. From town halls to peaceful protests, elected officials and community leaders have taken the lead to try to put an end to violence during National Gun Violence Awareness Month. Wave News reporter Brandon Spencer checked out these events and joins us. Brandon. Yeah, well, Marissa, the time of waiting around for change is over for people all over the country, but especially here in Louisville. And their stance is clear. They just want a world where they feel they can safely live in. So far this year, at least 73 people have been killed and more than 200 have been injured due to gun violence. Numbers people say they're tired of seeing rise. People are fed up. Uh, people want to make sure that we are talking about gun violence in a real way. Where we're talking about mental health. We're talking about root causes of crime and ways to make sure that people are doing better. And that we're talking about guns themselves. Representative McGarvey looking to do his part, hosting a town hall Saturday to address the gun violence and ways to combat it. He believes the use of red flag type laws can help people in a crisis get the help they need. Pointing to dialogue is a way to achieve it. Getting people together, organizing, listening, solving problems, pushing for real action, common sense gun reform is how we're going to make some, some progress on this and keep people safe. Gatherings like the Wear Orange Gun Violence Awareness Walk at Chickasaw Park. Different groups and community leaders gathered in the hope to create urgency for everyone to demand change. As we all wear this orange, we realize the toll it takes on families and friends and the entire community. That's why we're out here. That's our reason. That's our why. Organizers sharing that they won't quit until they no longer see their loved ones dead on the street. We losing our kids every day and they're not doing nothing. What's wrong with that picture? Representative McGarvey and those at Chickasaw Park urge lawmakers to hear their pleas and vow to continue to work to make the Commonwealth and the city of Louisville a safer place for kids to grow up in. Brandon Spencer, Wave News.